Hi, my name is Daniel Westbrook and today we're going to be installing some LVL beams in a kitchen remodel that we're doing because we'd like to expand the home space. Now one of the most important factors to consider when you're moving walls around in your home is are they bearing walls? This is why it's really important to employ the services of an architect and also an engineer so that if they are bearing walls, you can have beams designed to carry the proper loads. One of the reasons why these LVL beams are such a good choice for an existing condition like this is that they're light and you can bring them in in sections. And you can see behind me how tight the circumstances are here. We're going in from wall to wall. We've got a long way to haul these in and you can see how we've put them in place and we've got a hole in the wall on the outside in order to get them in. So it's kind of difficult conditions and because they're lighter, they're easier to handle, makes them easier to place. I also think it's uh, appropriate to take a moment to talk about what LVL beams are. This is very simple, just basically a laminated veneer lumber, LVL. It's basically, the, and this is what they kind of look like from the end grains, basically looks like a plywood, but this is a structural member. And actually what the beauty of these, and the reason why we like to use these in our remodels if we can, is that you can stack them together. You can laminate these things together to whatever size you want to make a much larger structural member when you're doing your installation. We're actually going to remove this old wall here to expand the space. Well, this wall is carrying a lot of load. So what you see here right here beside me is a temporary wall that we've installed in order to support the structure above while we're putting in our beam. Okay, so now with our supportive walls in place, it's time to go to work and take out the existing wall. Okay, so right behind me here, we've got our beam pocket and we've got our beam to be installed. The first thing I'm gonna do is put some glue in this old lath and plaster wall behind here to help solidify it. Now I've already ripped down this post in the shop to the right size. And I'm simply just gonna very gently put it in so this is, will be our LVL and the way we kind of planned it is we're going to slide this side in first and that, uh, that other side we're going to lift up right tight like that. So this short piece, I'm pushing on it. I'm tight against the ceiling there. It's a nice snug fit. I really like that. So that's, that's exactly where I want the post to go. So now that this post is installed on this side, we'll secure it all up later. We are ready to lift the LVLs in place and start working the other end. What I'm going to do is lift this beam, we'll get this temporary post underneath it, and we're going to secure it temporarily to this floor joist that's sticking down below the ceiling over here. Yes, yeah. We've just completed installing our beam and we've got it temporary supported. So I just measured for the post on the other end. I measured it a little bit tight so that we push the end of that beam in. And then after we install that post, the final step is going to be to secure all of these beams together with screws. I just measured for our post on the other end. So just mark this off and we'll just cut it. Pretty simple deal. Tighten these up, tighten them up together. So now that the beam is in and secured, we're going to take out our temporary support walls and take a look at the whole space. All right, so what we're doing here is we're installing these screws. These are a six inch screw. And so the next step is for us to put the screws in on our 
LV elves on either side of the beam. These LVL beams were a great option for us to install on this kitchen remodel because of the tight working circumstances. And as you can see behind me, the space has been expanded. It was a great usage of this material. Now we can continue on with our kitchen remodel. My name is Daniel Westbrook. We'll talk to you soon. For more of Dunn Solutions, subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment box below. We'll talk to you soon. Bye now.